Hello, my dears. How's everybody? So this is Ashley Mooney, Angel Intuitive, Spiritual Business Mentor and Author. And I'm here this week with your angel messages for the 18th of October. So October's been a bit of a funny month so far. I hope um, that things are going well wherever you are in the world and sending you love, whatever stage of lockdown that you're in. Hopefully, like here, I'm, I'm Irish, I'm living in Italy, things are opening up again the last few months. Kids are back in school and activities are back on. So it's looking good. And I hope the same for you and your family, wherever you are in the world. So this is a very interesting week. Let's get stuck straight in. So we have the page of Gabriel from Monday, Tuesday. Follow your passion. You're ready for any challenge, opportunities for excitement and adventure. So Monday, uh, the 18th, <laughs> suddenly Mercury retrograde is over and things can start to run a little bit smooth. I don't know if you've been experiencing this, but I've been experiencing delays and some tech difficulties and we had a, a website just wouldn't optimize for we had a web page just wouldn't optimize for mobile and people couldn't read it and <laughs> we just had a bit of crazy tech stuff happening in the background in our business but the good news is um that uh that energy is shifting now that energy is shifting and we're moving into energetic brave optimism playful so it's a lovely energy for the rest of the year and this this will continue of course we'll have our different energetic cycles every month and in the angel circle we work with different angels every month this month it's archangel raziel so it's past life and um, past life, like healing and taking your gifts from past lives to this life so there's there's a, a lot of happening but there's, there's that sense of a sense of playfulness or openness that's opening now in the middle of October, right until the end of the year. So it feels good. It feels good. We've been given a little bit of a break. So um, the middle of the week is the wheel, and it's about new beginnings, end of delays, a change in direction that offers happiness. So that theme continues um, about you know delays difficulties challenges everything's starting to feel a little bit like it's starting a bit more flow and um, things starting to come together you might get some more ideas about new projects or or resurface old ideas maybe yeah, you're thinking about i have a lot of books in my head at the moment and i know i need to just pick one and get started but i haven't been able to do that so i'm feeling that this week is a good week to to choose that project, that next project that you're going to spend in the next month or the next quarter or the next year. So brilliant. It's a lovely, lovely energy this month. It really, really is. The wheel is number 10. So it's it's a one energy, which is new beginnings, fresh start, and a zero energy. So it's a little bit of risk in there. There's a little bit of excitement. It's a little bit of um, jumping in and taking some risks in your life. So it's it's good. It's really, really good. And then the end of the week, towards the weekend, we have a page of a, um, Ariel, reliable, clever, educated, balanced. An excellent opportunity will be offered to you, scholarships or the pursuit of education and time to get to work. So this is, especially if you have a business or a spiritual business, there's just a sense of go and get the training that you need, go and get the marketing, um, the marketing training that you need. Go and get the coach, go and get the mentoring, go and, and get the community. I mentioned um, in a live stream that I did recently for spiritual business entrepreneurs that without support, I just would not have built the business that I have today. I would not have made the money that I made today without the support of my community, of my peers, fellow entrepreneurs on the path with me, friends. Um, and my clients and the different, like all of those communities, without that, I just would not be here at all. I would probably wouldn't be still in business without that support of people going, keep going, even in the, in the challenging times. So there's something about towards the end of the week, um, and it will start to surface at the beginning of the week. There's something about an opportunity for you to get some deeper learning, to work with a teacher or a coach that you've been thinking about working with for a long time. Um, 
you know, something new will be offered to you. Whether it's in business, I really feel like it's more in business. But if, if you don't have a business and you're watching this, it could be more in your personal life. It could be more about following one of your passions or your hobbies. You're like knitting. You might just decide to dive in and, and buy a, a pattern or join a membership. Or if you um, want to write a book, you'll suddenly have the idea or that coach or teacher will agree to help you to do that. So it's a really lovely week. It's a really, really lovely week ahead. New energy. It feels very light. It feels very exciting. And new beginnings, fresh start, opportunities, new ideas. And um, it's going to be a great week. Um, please, wherever you're watching this video, like it, share it with anyone that you think might need this little bit of a, a nudge, an angel nudge this week. Um, you can find me at ashlingmooney.com. If you want to join our angel circle, you can go to ashlingmooney.com forward slash members and you can check that out. And everything else is on the website. If you're a spiritual business entrepreneur, go to ashlingmooney.com forward slash breakthrough. And that will give you free four masterclasses and two Q&A sessions around everything um, in your spiritual business. Great support there. Loads of love, my darlings. Have an amazing week, and I'll see you next week. Bye for now.